Welcome Capricorn, Sun, Moon or Rising. This is your March 2017 forecast. Please watch all of your videos, Sun, Moon or Rising, as one may not be making sense to you, but all three will give you a full, free, accurate reading. If you want a reading with me, use the link below, www.hypnoula.com. Also, if you want your whole year forecast in advance, $4.99 per video on Vimeo On Demand, use the link below. So you, right now, are at work. Uh, you're soul searching, you are looking at your future, you are one on one dealing with a Virgo Capricorn Taurus, or oh, this is you just looking at your future in this place. Your accounts are frozen, your money is frozen, or the accounts are frozen, and so this is making you stop, look, and listen about what you're going to do uh, in, further in, in the future. You are expanding your view. This is higher education. This is looking at where you've come from and looking at where you are right now and, and, and thinking about the future. Soul searching. Something has happened that during the month of March, you are looking at your future within this company, within the school, within your position. Is this something you want to continue, to continue with? Is this coming to an end? Are you going to expand on that? Are you going to have higher education to make this expand in a different direction? You know, there's been some sort of halt where you are making this crossroads decision. It is a major arcana card, and there is enlightenment. Um, you are, maybe your funds are frozen because you put as much of them as you can, and you can't make any movements forward until the next money comes in, or you get a yes or no on the loan. Uh, and because you're looking at the past, and you're looking at your experience. And you're looking about where you can take this. This can be about, you know, you've got that enlightenment. Maybe you're expanding online. Maybe you're expanding into different areas. Maybe you're going to make a complete change. Um, but you're, you're communicating. You are talking. You are listening. Maybe that's the point. Maybe you weren't listening or maybe you weren't hearing. Maybe it was the communication issue, a miscommunication. Because this month, um, Capricorn, you are working one-on-one, -on -one, working independently, you're reflecting, you're having soul searching, and this is a major change, a crossroads decision for you. At home, you have the Ace of Pentacles, so you might be getting receiving money uh, and inheritance, receiving a loan, uh, receiving funds. Uh, money is coming to you from an unlikely source. This is also a fresh new cycle to do with money. Uh, this is signing up for uh, a new home, a uh, You also could be moving in with someone, combining forces. This is a divine intervention, but it's an ace, so it's a fresh new start. And after the 26th of February, it was a Pisces uh, a solar eclipse uh, on a new moon. So you going in, Capricorn, going into March, you are... You might be moving in with someone new, getting a brand new job, which is brand new money, because this is ace. It's divinely given to you. This is Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. This is money coming from an unlikely source, but this is in a positive, new, fresh cycle that leads on to your dream life. You can see that there. That's what's being given to you. Ta practical, tangible, um, putting putting practical, tangible measures into your routine. Right? New. This is new, practical, tangible um, you know, uh, savings, um, physical if it's around the home, a new routine, uh, a new diet, whatever it is that you're practically, tangibly putting money into that is new, this is leading you on to your perfect, your perfect um, life that you wanted. Now, this can also be coming out of the blue from another uh, earth sign as well. This is financial and uh, physical stability. Uh, that is new. It's a new cycle. With your health, you do have the world card, and the world card says that you might be traveling um, to uh, resolve a physical issue, that you are at the last stages of resolving your health, that you are uh, proud of your body because you've been working on this for a while, and you're just about there. You're just about achieving uh, and satisfied and completing that process to be where you are. Now, with your partnerships, you are looking about leaving uh, with a fire sign. So you, Capricorn, Either you or your fire sign partner is looking at, this is the two guide, you're looking, do I want to stay or do I want to go? 
Now, in conjunction with that, that can also be because one or the other has been offered a role that will uh, make you decide between my lover, uh, my partner, and the role because there's movement, there's relocation. Um, so that's the second one. Now, the third one is, is you and your partner could be looking out into the world about relocating completely, relocating towns, uh, countries, uh, on the move together um, as well. For some of you, this is about moving in together. So moving in together or moving, relocating together. Uh, and then there's, of course, like I said, the first one, which would be either you or uh, the, the earth sign or the fire sign is looking out to the world saying, you know, do I, am I done with this relationship? I don't know. Uh, Mystique says, have faith and hope that I, well, Mercury retrograde shadow starts on the 27th. Uh, right through to May the 15th, I think. And so that whatever you are worried about will come back on the table through that period. So between March and May, uh, that's where the solution, the miracle will come. Um, transition needs to happen for things to be shaken up to go into the way that you want it to go. Have a fabulous month. Be kind to you and those you love. Please do check the Vimeo for your whole year. Uh, and if you want a reading with me, www.hapnewyla.com.